Today I'm going to show you how to get unlimited free hotspot tethering on your phone. This is only working on Android. Um, it also depends on the carrier you have. Um, right now I'm going to be doing it with Metro PCS. Um, that is confirmed working with this method. There are other methods out there, but this one is definitely working for Metro PCS. I have not tried any other carrier, um, but there, I have read on some of the forms that it is possible with some of the other carriers. So without further ado, here we go. The first app you're going to want to download on your phone is, and I'm sorry about the potato quality. This I'm recording this on a you know an old HTC M8 um, but you're gonna want to go into your Play Store uh, download PDA net install it and then open it once you uh, install it you're gonna want to make sure that hide tether usage is checked and USB tether is checked then you're gonna want to go into your settings on your device because I'm running Android Oreo it may be different for you, uh, but in my settings, it is in, uh, you're going to want to go to system, about phone, and then build number, tap it a bunch of times, and you'll unlock uh, developer options. I already have it unlocked, so then you're going to want to go into system, developer options, and enable USB debugging. Okay, once you have that, you're going to want to make sure you are connected to your, your phone is connected to your computer um, via USB. Okay, go on to your computer. Go on to your computer. Uh, search PDA. Net. Download PDA, this website right here. Install it. This will only work on Windows. I'm sorry, I forgot to mention that. Once it's installed, you know, go through the installer ins uh, instructions. I'm just going to go ahead and show you right here. It might warn you um, that it's a virus. However, it is not. It's a false positive. It just says that because there's a lot of things in this program that is uh, very technical and... Um, Sometimes the, those sort of things get flagged. Okay. Just click run. Yes. Um, I'm going to abort the installation, but you just go through the installation process. Okay, once, once it's installed, it should be down here, whether you're using Windows 10 or not, or Windows 7. Um, it should always be here. It's right there. Ooh. Anyway, uh, it's always going to be there. Right click, that means right click the one that you normally don't use, you know, the same one you use to copy and paste. Um, and then it won't say disconnect for you, but what it will say is um, connect USB. So I'm just going to go ahead and disconnect temporarily here just to show you it in action here. Connect USB, this will pop up, connected. Now, I with Metro PCS have four, five gigabytes of hotspot. Uh, of high speed hotspot. When I'm using browsing the web, for example, or if I'm watching Netflix or just watching, you know, YouTube, um, I don't run into any issues um, regarding anything. So I've been using this on Netflix for, I've used over 200 and something gigabytes uh, hotspot wise now because you gotta make sure that high tether usage is enabled in your PDA app. Now there is another thing I would like to mention here is uh, there is a limit. You have to buy the full version of PDA.net. It's about $2, um, but it's worth every penny because if you have Metro PCS, it's guaranteed to work. Um, I wouldn't recommend um, purchasing it until you test it out on your carrier if you don't have Metro PCS. If it works for you and you use like a whole bunch of gigabytes of hotspot um, with no problem, then I would upgrade to the FoxFi version, which is you just go ahead and install FoxFi and they work hand to hand together, PDA and FoxFi. Sorry, I'm trying to 
There we go. Nope. Foxfy looks like this. Why is it so blurry right now? Anyway, Fox Fi. This app right here is the one you're gonna want. Um, you don't need root for this method, which is surprising. You used to need root. Um, this is going to unlock a full version. I already unlocked the full version. Um, by downloading this, you can unlock the full version of PDA. Um, and PDA, the limited version allows like five gigabytes as well. Um, and if it doesn't count toward, if you, when you're using PDA and you notice it's not counting towards your carrier's limit, then by all means do it. Um, if not, uh, then I recommend not purchasing it because it's really not worth $2 if you don't get unlimited hotspot out of it. Um, this has been Virtual Victory, guys, signing off.